Hey everybody, what's going on? Speedy Diver here, and this is night 188 of GameStop Dumpster Diving. Tonight, I think there's actually posters over here, which is pretty cool. I haven't found posters in a long time, actually. And there's a bag in this box, and it looks like there's a piece of paper. It's probably just a piece of paper or a win prize. It's an NBA thing, so I guess, I don't know, I probably won't take that, but either way, I'll keep it in the box. I guess this will be my trusty dusty box tonight, because... It, the bag's are already in the box. I mean, hey, it is what it is. So let's go through the posters first. But before I do and actually show you guys, I don't even know what these posters are yet because obviously they're flipped upside down. But before I get into those, I want to let you guys know I am doing a giveaway very, very soon. The only requirements of the giveaway is to be a subscriber and also be very active on the channel by liking, commenting on videos. That's pretty much it. So let's get into this. We'll look at the posters first and see what they are. It looks like we have a razor poster. That's pretty cool, actually. I might keep that and just cut that part out of it for the razor. It is a little soggy. I don't know why. It's, it feels a little soggy, like it's a little wet. I don't know why. I have no clue. But either way, I'll throw it over there. I probably won't end up keeping that. Next one we have is Power A. Charge, play, and win. That's kind of cool. I really don't need that either, though. Because if it was something cool, like a game poster or something for, like, a Call of Duty or, like, a Gears of War, I'd probably keep it. Like this one right here. This is... Sniper 3, that's pretty cool, but it's not, it has too much promotional stuff on it, in my opinion, but it is still really damn cool. Sniper 3, Ghost Warrior. It is pretty cool, but I probably won't take it. We have a, I had found one of these before, so I'm not going to take this one either, but I have found one very similar for the Pokemon stuff. My sister loves Pokemon, so it, it is really cool. There's Yoshi's uh, Woolly World, there's Pokemon Sun, Pokemon Moon, there's even the new Galaxy style uh, 3DS XL. And it shows you all the games you can buy. These are all the games, obviously. Uh, Mario Maker, Super Mario Maker 3DS. There's Mario Sports Superstars over there as well. Pretty cool. Luigi's hat's flying off. I just kick him in the soccer ball. That's pretty awesome. And then we also have this one, which is already right side up. And there's even another one. Sweet. Oops, sorry about that. I thought I saw something. I guess I didn't. Uh, here we go, though. This is the Vive. Which is HTC, I'm pretty sure. The HTC Vive, which is pretty much just virtual reality. That's kind of cool. He's like getting out of the chair. This is like the original game, uh, original way of gaming, which is just like sitting down playing games. And then he makes his way up. It's like the caveman thing when he's like crawling and then he makes his way walking. That's what they probably did with this. It looks pretty cool. I'm not going to take it though. I really don't need it. It's all promotional stuff pretty much just for these companies and whatnot. And we have Charge Block. Huh. I have never really heard of that. I, obviously, it's a charging thing, but I never heard of charge block before. The most versatile controller charger available. That's kind of cool. Never heard of it, but still pretty cool. Just do one side of it. And there's also a box over here. Maybe there's something in it. Nope, looks like there's nothing in there, but that looks like it's pretty much it. I'm about to make our way into the bag. So the one and only bag tonight, everything else in the dumpster is not GameStop related or it's just all trash anyway. So let's get into this either way. Hope you guys are going to really enjoy this video because I hope there's something really amazing in here to show everybody because I have no clue yet. It's, it's a, like I consider these giant mystery bags. That's what I consider them. And let's get into this and figure out what's inside. Like there could be absolutely nothing. But for the most part, usually I find some pretty amazing stuff. Ooh, what is that? Oh, I made a really loud sound. We have a case. It actually has some weight to it, too. What the hell is this? Hold on, I gotta use two hands to open the zipper. As you guys can see, there's a zipper on this side that I'm holding. I just closed it. Okay, give me a second. <laughs> okay, what's inside? How do you open this thing? Wait, hold on, how the hell do you open this thing? I didn't even open it up all the way. You gotta be kidding me. Give me one more second. Here we go. The moment of truth. What the hell is that? What's oh, a freaking fidget spinner? Is that what that is? Wait, hold on, what? Th they make carrying cases for these things? That's freaking awesome. You guys have heard of these, right? These are called fidget spinners. You take it, you can go like this and stuff, and I'm probably not doing this right because I don't own one, but you can go like that. Yeah, whoa, that is so cool. I can't do this. I, I don't know how to do this. There we go, whoa, that is so freaking awesome. What the hell, why is this here? Maybe, okay, the only guess I have of why this is actually in the dumpster is probably because somebody left it in the store. The employees probably didn't know what it was and they just threw it out. That's probably why. But a freaking fidget spinner, that is so freaking cool. Oh, I'm so happy. That's really cool. I actually wanted to get one of these too. And I didn't want to spend like 15 bucks for it because the ones in like uh, stores are really cheap. 
and it even comes with a cleaning cloth. Like, I don't even think this is supposed to be in that case, to be honest, because I don't think they sell these with cases. But that's freaking awesome. It's literally just, it's a little dirty, but it's basically brand new. Oh, I'm freaking out. This is so cool. It's, it's in a brand new case, too. I mean, the case probably isn't for it. I'm putting that in my pocket. That is freaking awesome. Okay, let's see what else we have. We found one awesome thing so far tonight. Let's see what number two is. We have a book right here. Another one of these. This is the third one in the past like week and a half or two weeks I found this. Pretty much, if you guys don't know what this is, if you haven't watched my other videos, it pretty much, it's a book that you can just buy like a tape dispenser in. You can buy gloves, you can buy packaging, shipping material, uh, tape, poster tubes, bubble wrap. You can buy everything from that cat. It's pretty much a catalog. That's what it is. I don't want that though. Because <laughs> I'm not going to be buying bubble wrap. Ooh, what is this? Ooh, is there a, like a card in there? What is this? Hold on, let me focus that back in. I think it's a piece of styrofoam. I'm going to open it up either way, though. I need two hands for this as well. Okay, I can't open it, but I don't think anything's in there. As you can see, it's already cut. Yeah, there's nothing in there. There would have been like a... I think a PS Vita game or something. I don't know what would have been in there, but that's pretty cool as well. I'm not going to keep it, though. Let's see what this is. Welcome to Jurassic Park. It's on Blu-ray. Just a promotional little piece of paper. That's all that is. Oh, we got a rubber band. I'm going to keep that for my rubber band ball. <laughs> if you guys haven't seen the rubber band ball video already that I actually did, Link will be in the description down below. It was freaking awesome. Hopefully, I can update it very soon. Everyone seemed to love it. That was my 100th episode of pretty much every, like on my channel. And everyone just loved the idea. And it was just a really good video. So go check it out. This was apparently for Yokai Watch, I believe. These are Yokai Watch figures. There's nothing inside, obviously, because the box is flat. But there we go. Another box. Maybe these figures are in here. I'd be, I would die if they were. I really would. That'd be so cool. Yo, let's take this bag out of here. Eh, no, I'm going to keep it. Ooh, ooh, there's actually stuff on the bottom of the box. No way. Are these games? No, they're sleeves. But there's a case thing right there, too. We have, okay, we have SmackDown versus Raw. It's just a sleeve, though, for the Xbox 360. I'll still keep it, though. If ever I find the game, I could put it or put this in the case and then put the, kit, the game in the case. So I'll keep that. That's pretty cool. We actually have a little CD case right here as well. Which, I'll keep that too, because I can probably just put a game in there. We have an NBA 2K14. Is Xbox One? Oh, it's coming soon, that's why. It's an Xbox 360 sleeve. Or not sleeve, it's a manual. Sweet. Pretty awesome. We have a Sniper Elite 3 manual, which is awesome. I did unbox the collector's edition of this as well. I'll leave a link in the description down below as well for that video. And yeah, an 8.2 rating. This game was pretty damn good. I gotta say, this game was really, really good. Sniper Elite 3, this is the sleeve part of it. Fight Night Champion, this is for Xbox 360, just a sleeve. Let's see if there's anything else. There is more. What the hell? That is so cool. We have Grid Autosport, just a sleeve for the Xbox 360, as well as some pamphlets and a code. If you guys want that code, it says activate your online pass. You guys can have it because I don't really know what it's for. I'm not going to keep it because I'm giving the code away. So there we go. We have a nothing. Oh. I thought it was going to be like a mini poster or something. It absolutely was nothing. Always go to the bottom of the bag. You never know what you're going to find. If you guys see all these gift cards and stuff like that, they never have any money on them. I never checked them. I used to when I first started dumpster diving, but I've never found anything on them before, so I just stopped doing it. So, because it's kind of pointless. It's just a waste of time. Is that a pin? This is why you always go to the bottom of the bag. Okay, it's the back side of a pin. It's not an actual pin. It's the part that clips into the sharp part of it i'll keep that as well because maybe the rest of the pin is actually in here so i have to make sure i go into the bottom of the bag now and look really really close let's find that pin where is it i'm really hoping there's a pin in here not that there's nothing in here there's just that little back of a pin i really think there's no pin in here well that's really sad so i'm gonna go through this a little bit because yeah there's even this right here oh this is from the beginning of the video so pretty much what we have tonight, which tonight was really successful in my opinion, found all those sleeves as well as a freaking rubber band <laughs> and a fidget spinner. Like what the hell? A fidget spinner. That is so freaking cool. That, and it works. It's not like it's broken. It actually spins. 
what the hell? <laughs> I would assume if it was broken, they throw it out. I guess the employees just didn't know what it was, to be honest, because when I first saw one of these, I had no clue what it was when I uh, originally saw these online. I don't know who I saw it from, but it was from a, uh, a YouTuber, a famous YouTuber that I actually found this from, uh, like knowing what it actually is. So pretty cool. I heard these things are really popular too. A lot of people know what these are and stuff. Really, really awesome. And it comes with a cleaning cloth and a case, which I don't think it actually came in this. Somebody just probably put it in there and just threw it out. Hope you guys really enjoyed the video. Don't forget to always like, comment, subscribe. Tonight was a really good night in my opinion because this thing's pretty freaking cool. I mean, I'll fidget around with it while like I'm just doing random crap. I don't know. Something cool. And there's also the, if I can find it in my pocket, which I can't find it in my pocket. Did I drop it? Hold on. Here it is. The back of the pin as well so that's pretty much all i found tonight hope you guys really enjoyed the video don't forget to always like comment subscribe remember the giveaway all you have to do is be a subscriber be very active on the channel and just by liking commenting on videos and just stay cool that's all i'm asking it's gonna be a freaking awesome giveaway I, d I didn't tell anybody what it is yet i will tell you guys very very soon what's gonna be in the giveaway when i get the package and i can make a separate video on it so stay tuned for that i hope you guys enjoyed follow me on twitter i post every time i post an or tweet every time i post a new video Watch the last video over there, subscribe to the Speedy Diver over there, as well as subscribe to the Speedy Gamer. I do gaming videos. So if you don't know about that, go check it out. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll catch you on the flip side.